What's happening people? Today we are in Malone's bar with the Irish cocktail guy at Instagram at the Irish cocktail guy. My good friend Matthew is going to be making a few cocktails for Malone's bar. So Matthew, tell us a wee bit about the like your business and stuff like that and just like what you're planning and doing with it. I've made cocktails for a long time. Started off in America and I just thought you see all these people on Instagram who are like really really good at making cocktails but they're not accessible. You look at the recipes and you're like, geez, it's like I couldn't make that at all, or I'm gonna to need to go and climb two mountains, pick some stuff up, yeah. and then put it on the sun for about six hours yeah. before I can make a syrup to make that cocktail. So my idea is to make cocktails that are accessible, easy to follow. You walk into Tesco and you can just kind of grab whatever you need, and that's not plug to Tesco. You can go to anywhere you want, Aldi, Lidl, uh, support local, go to your local shops. Tesco, uh, you owe me money for this. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, basically, Matty's just gonna like make a few cocktails for us, and maybe I'll get a few cheeky cocky teas. Well, maybe yeah. one or two. Maybe maybe get me good and drunk and they can take me home after. But yeah, so we're Wouldn't just gonna <laughs> we're just gonna get straight into it and just make some cocktails. So uh, I'll see you in a little bit. Hi, I'm Matthew the Irish Cocktail Guy. I'm in Malone's Glasgow uh, and I'm going to show you how to make a cocktail. Give it a bit of a shave. Should I get any ground into it? And from here. So my main man Matty has just made a basil smash as you could see in the previous footage so I'm going to try it. I'm not really a big fan of like basil and stuff like that so uh, I might not like it. But you will. You will like it. Mm. You'll tell everyone you like it because it's my drink. It's actually alright to be honest. Aye so uh, definitely go check out Irish Cocktail Guy for some homemade uh, Irish cocktails because this is actually quite nice. Can I drink this? I can drink it if you want but I mean if basil's not your thing we can make it with mint. Your old dad's gonna get fucking steam in the night. <laughs> so, Matthew, guess what kind of cocktail are you gonna show me how to make? Well, originally we thought we'd make an espresso martini and then we kind of changed from that. Why don't we go for a white Russian with German liqueur and that German liqueur would be German liqueur. I don't really know what if Jägermeister's liqueur, but we'll go with Jägermeister. Fuck oh, man. I don't think I've had Jägermeister since I was like 16. But I. Um, whatever. Let's go for it. So what you need, you need your glass. Okay. First of all, so take your glass, fill it with ice. Okay, so I've got my glass. I'm gonna fill it with ice. Right up to the top now. Right up to the top, Jesus Christ. Man, don't be stingy. <laughs> there we go, look at that then. Right, take your vodka. Okay, so we've got, oh, espresso vodka, which, I mean, I like a coffee. I don't like a wee coffee. <laughs> okay, so we've we got 25 this. mils of espresso vodka in it. So that's mad thing. It's a jigger. A jigger? It's not a mad thing. A mad thing. Come on, don't be stingy. Pour a wee bit more. more. You just pour it over the glass though, because you don't want to waste any. So right, spillage, okay. spillage is leakage and all that. Okay, Dad. Jesus Christ, you're trying to get me drunk. And pour it in. Okay. You're going to have to lick that up. What's that? You're going to have to lick that up. It's it's quite nice. Uh, hey. Hi. Straight <laughs> vodka from a bar. Right, take your Jaeger and then do 25 mils of that. We'll see how it turns out. 25 mils of Jaeger. So guys, I mean the page is Irish Cocktail Bar, but uh, if you really want to come to me, I will happily make a cocktail. I wouldn't go down. Just, just one cocktail, but it might be a Colombian cocktail if you know what I mean. <laughs> so, I'm going to add some vanilla syrup, so take that and fill that 25ml jigger, about 10ml or something like that, should be grand. Okay, I don't like the consistency of that, Matty. I mean it is sugar. But I said uh, 10ml, not uh, 25 but oh, right, well, so just do it. We're, just put we're putting in. 25 in, this, this is... is it, you're already <laughs> sweet enough. It's, uh, it's my video, so I'll do what I want. Alright, <laughs> take, take your spoon and give it a wee bit of a stir. So, we've got this lovely wee... It's a bar spoon. It's a bar spoon. Uh, right, you're okay. meant to be able to do loads of stuff with it that I can't do, but... Let's see if I can do it then. So oh. you stir it. Alright. Okay. Stir around. Okay. So as you can see, I'm a professional. Alright, and then what I want you to do is take more ice and fill it to the top. More ice? But I'm fucking hacking everywhere. Here. Next thing's next. <laughs> first thing's first. First thing is about the ten thing. Take your shaker. Okay. Right. Uh, take a jigger. 
drink anything? Eh, uh, well, I don't really need to take a drink. Pour about roughly half and half vodka or milk and cream into your shaker. This is just going to be used for the head and the top. Fuck it, so half and half. Let's put a wee bit of like chocolate. Oh, chocolate as well. Here we go. You've already done enough of the sugar. Ooh. 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 I'm not going to lie, I'm kind of aroused. <laughs> I kind of aroused just the way they came out. What a brown stuff. Aye. Mm -hmm. So, they each their own. Oh, Jesus, calm down. Say when, say when. <laughs> say when. Is that enough? In, uh, I'll be grand. Then put in about the same amount of milk, or uh, cream. Right side. Right, then take, move about five ice cubes and put it in there. Then take this, so what you need to do is you place that on the bar, take this, put it in at an angle, and then hold it and give it a good bash in so it's nice and solid. I'll tell you when it's got a seal. So, like that, and then hit it with your palm of your hand. Okay. A little bit harder than that. Harder? Yeah. I'm spanking my missus. <laughs> Alright, now take it. Okay. I don't want you to, you can do it two ways. You can do it like that, or how I like to do it is you take two fingers. So, two fingers. Uh huh. Two fingers here, and shake it back and forth. Okay. So, right. try not to make any faces, because there is a rumour that the face you make when you're shaking a cocktail is the face you make when you do something else. So, it's just. And you are, have a lot of white stuff. It's just me looking terrified then. Alright. <laughs> <laughs> nice like this. Yeah. Right. And then you want to shake it back and forth over your, over your shoulder. I like the customer when you're charging them. Give it a bit more of a shake. But we're going to get that really frothy. Do you want to get that custom consistency in it? Come on, you're having a good night, aye. <laughs> I rattle you. Uh, so what, what you really want is this to get really cold okay. at the bottom. So keep shaking it until it gets really cold. Like back and forth. Yeah, you keep, keep your back into it. I'm trying! Right, so once you've done that, okay. I want you to take this. At the front, see where the gap is? You put one thumb there and push in, and I want you to hit it with the, your other. Oh, I did it for you there. Oh, I'm right. oh, making it easy. You've, you've just ruined my day then. Okay, right. So, thumb here, yeah, and push in. Push in like this? Yeah, with that thumb, push in to you, and then hit it with the other hand. Right, okay. So I'm like. Yeah, hit the metal more with the, the with this bit of your hand. Ah, right, there okay. we go. Ah, okay, yeah. Right, so what you need to do is you need to take your strainer. Strainer? Uh, so you hold it, and you're kind of wanting to hold it kind of like that, so you're holding it down. This is the bottom, and then what you need to do is take your spoon, you can do this, move this out of the way. So you want to take your spoon, and hold it, and pour it in, so hopefully we can get a good layer effect here. If not, well... So I'm holding it like this, and just uh, pouring it in. Uh, that'll do the job. Look at that, man! Going right to the top, now right to the top. Look at that. Keep going. Look at that. Oh, well, you've just kind of ruined your layering effect there. Oh, but yeah, do you know what it is? Yes. As long as it tastes nice. So, just based on that, do you think I could get a job in a bar? What do you think? Any, any jobs going <laughs> now? Well, I, I mean, you kind of did a bit of layering. Oh, look at that, that's amazing. <laughs> no, I don't know what Right, so the taste test. You might want to stir it. I mean, that's just how you present it, kind of, but you just might want to stir it. I just think, to get uh, the mix is, it up. This is going to go everywhere if I spill this. Uh, well, maybe take a wee sip out of it first then. Right, okay, okay, I'll take a wee sip. I mean, it's, it's not bad. No, but the cream? Aye. <laughs> <laughs> the cream's not bad. Right, so there it is. What are you going to call it? Is your, well, it's not really your cocktail, but. Uh, I'm going to call it a. Colum Name Colombian powder white oh, cocktail. So none of the ingredients are from, from Colombia, but you're happy enough calling it that. Well, the maker's Colombian, so uh, that's quite nice. Is it? Can I try it? That's actually not bad. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I'm really surprised. I thought it was going to be terrible. Not because of the cocktail, but because you were making it. I well now I'm going to finish this and get hammered, but eh. Uh, Aye, so don't forget to follow my man, Irish Cocktail Guy on Instagram. Also, do us a favour and go follow Malone's Bar on Instagram as well. I'll put a wee link or put it here somewhere. And uh, until next time, guys, I'll see you later.